10 News starts right now. Right now at 4.30, a 15-year-old charged with murder, accused of holding a man hostage, robbing him at an ATM, and then shooting him. This happened last month along Northwest 15 Terrace in Fort Lauderdale. And that teen is being charged now as an adult, and Local 10's Roy Ramos is live in Fort Lauderdale with these new details. Roy. Christian Louie, well, the victim in this case was found shot several times after crashing his vehicle right into this home. But at the time, Fort Lauderdale police had no idea who shot him. Well, they have arrested that killer. And again, he is just 15 years old. Good morning. You are Mr. Lewis. 15 year old Henry Lee Lewis faced a Broward County judge Saturday after investigators with Fort Lauderdale police said he kidnapped, robbed and then shot and killed a real estate agent February 1st. I know it says you're 15 years old, but you've been charged as an adult uh, with a first count of murder. According to the arrest report we obtained, Lewis confronted 37 year old Stefano Barbosa as he was about to visit tenants near the 600 block of Northwest 15th Terrace in Fort Lauderdale. That's when police said Lewis held the man at gunpoint, forced him to drive to an ATM to withdraw $1,000 and then shot him several times. Uh, those are not bondable offenses. Following that shooting, we told you how the victim crashed into this home before detectives said Lewis ran away. Investigators able to track him down through surveillance cameras in the neighborhood. Close friends like Jason Lewis hearing the details of the case for the first time, still numb knowing Barbosa was murdered while just trying to do his job. It's pretty crazy when one of your, when one of your friends and neighbors, you know, gets gunned down like that. He was just always there for you, anything you needed. Um, you know, and just a very, you know, very generous person. And Lewis is now being held in the Broward County Jail with no bond. We did learn that he does have a lengthy criminal history that dates back to 2018, where he was charged with an armed robbery at just the age of 12. For now here in Fort Lauderdale, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News. That is so disturbing. Okay, thanks so much, Roy.